One of my favorite party go-tos is a simple charcuterie board. So when my brother had a housewarming party and asked me to help at the last minute, I knew we could throw one together. What is this called? Pillsbury dough crescent roll. So good. First, I gathered everything we had so I could see what we were working with. Then I started cutting up the veggies and the cheese. Cutting cucumbers. Whoops, gotta smush that cheese back together and might as well eat some while I'm at it. One of my must-haves on any charcuterie board is a yummy goat cheese. Usually I make my own, but this time I was in a pinch, so I got something from the store. And then of course I add some good old cheddar cheese for those plain Janes out there. Next, you wanna make sure to add a meat spread. When you're in a time crunch, these pre-made meat and cheeses are super helpful. But if you're feeling super Martha Stewart-y, then you can totally make your own. Oh, and I always love a good hummus. I even filled this bowl with some ice so that the hummus would stay nice and fresh. Then you just start assembling your board. You want it to be pretty and pleasing to the eye. That way your guests feel guilty when they're eating it. <laughs> just kidding. Then you can write out and label your items. That way people know what they're eating. So I like to put each item at a slightly different direction and angle. It's really simple and it's super hard to do this wrong. Just have a really good time. Then I add my bread and crackers and fruit in between all the cheeses and it's just super pretty and gorgeous. You will wow all of your guests and they'll think you spent a ton of time on it. Look, this board is like one big happy family. Now it's time to enjoy. Let me know your tips and tricks on making your charcuterie board. I'd love to hear them. So comment below and I can't wait to see you guys next week.